Good evening, I'm Heather Skoll. And I'm Bart Bensoul. Thanks for making us your choice for news at 10 o'clock. A radio show in Birmingham, Alabama is causing major shockwaves in Colorado Springs, where the fight continues to keep U.S. Space Command in Colorado Springs. Former President Donald Trump confessed in an interview that the decision to move Space Command from Peterson to Huntsville's Redstone Arsenal was his decision alone. It's our top story tonight. Cardio News Channel 13 Scott Harrison sought out to see if the former president revelation would change anything. Former President Donald Trump sounded proud when he told the Rick and Bubba show that he made the decision to take Space Command from Colorado Springs in favor of Huntsville, Alabama. But the former president gave few details about why. By the way, Space Force I sent to Alabama. I hope you know that. Yeah, yes, and we appreciate that. We Huntsville is very Force. appreciative. Yeah, they are. <laughs> yeah, they said that we're looking for a home. And I single-handedly said, let's go to Alabama. They wanted it. I said, let's go to Alabama. So, hey, look, I, I love Alabama. I love what they're doing. Back in Colorado Springs, Mayor John Southers found the revelation stunning, but in a good way. Obviously, it's not a surprise that he did it. It's a surprise that he admitted it. Um, and I'm glad he did, because uh, at least that's going to... Uh, remove the facade that this was the bait, you know, the result of a meritorious Air Force process. The response to Trump's comments were swift today. The governor and lieutenant governor issued a joint statement that reads, quote, these callous comments fly in the face of those who have worked to cultivate our aerospace ecosystem and called Trump's decision misguided. Congressman Doug Lamborn added, quote, this proves that claims by the Air Force that the decision was merit-based are completely false. This has been my concern all along and calls into question the entire selection process. Mayor Southers also says that instead of former President Trump's decision being reversed, the mayor wouldn't be surprised if the entire selection process started over again, and it has already done once before. In fact, he feels the chances of that happening may be better and former President Trump's decision being overturned. But local residents feel more confident now that Trump's admission will be evidence used by two ongoing government investigations into the selection process to keep Space Command here. 1,400 jobs and nearly a half billion dollars of economic impact are at stake.